Hey cosplayers, welcome to another great cosplay quick tip clip. In today's video, we're gonna talk about how you can make your FOMO, or foam clay, uh, last longer. Increase the working time when you're working with it to prevent it from drying out on you while you sculpt. If you're excited about this video and wanna learn how to increase your working time, type last in the comments below. Just go on right down, right now, type the word last. On your way back up, hit that subscribe button and that bell notification to be notified of all of our uh, videos whenever they come out so you can stay on top of your game. Cosplay like a boss. With that, let's dive in. So, we got a little tub of FOMO here. Just gonna pull out a little bit. Now, I'll tell you right off the bat here that the, uh, the secret is just a little thing of water. <laughs> all right, so let's say you're sitting here sculpting. We've got our little sculpting tool. I don't know what I'm sculpting. Uh, I'm making a uh, Charizard head, okay? <laughs> and, um, you know, it starts to, I'm getting worried about it drying out on me before I'm done, something like that. So as I'm working, I'm just, just continuously kind of dip your finger in some water and just kind of work it along the surface of the foam. And then you can kind of keep going, keep sculpting your stuff. And then just every so often you just keep adding that extra little bit of, uh, you know, um, extra little bit of water, dipping your fingers in there, just rub it smooth. That'll help keep both, that'll both help keep your product smooth as you go. Um, and then it'll also help increase your working time so it's, the surface isn't drying out on you. Because the first thing to dry out will be the surface. And once that surface dries, if you guys saw our monster skin effect video on how to make a cool monster skin effect with FOMO, um, then you know that uh, if that surface dries, it starts to then create kind of a layer on the surface uh, that will start to kind of peel or bubble and different things like that, or ripple if you try to bend it too much. But uh, yeah, so there you go. Pretty simple um, trick. Just dip your finger in some water and just continually uh, Rub it across the surface just to keep it uh, moist so that it doesn't dry out on you while you're working. Hopefully this is a helpful tip for you guys. Uh, if you guys uh, found this helpful or you like this video, give it a like. If you didn't, a uh, dislike is fine too. <laughs> but hopefully it's a like. Share it with a friend if you know that somebody that can benefit that works with uh, FOMO or other foam clays. And uh, yeah, we'll catch you guys in the next video. Thank you guys so much. Cosplay on my friends.